What is the organ responsible for pumping blood in our body? The heart is responsible for pumping blood. What is the organ responsible for pumping blood in our body? The heart is responsible for pumping blood. Which part of the body helps us breathe? The lungs help us breathe by taking in oxygen. Which part of the body helps us breathe? The lungs help us breathe by taking in oxygen. What is the main function of the brain? The brain is responsible for controlling our thoughts and actions. What is the main function of the brain? The brain is responsible for controlling our thoughts and actions. Which part of the body contains the vocal cords? The larynx contains the vocal cords, allowing us to speak. Which part of the body contains the vocal cords? The larynx contains the vocal cords, allowing us to speak. What do we use to see things? We use our eyes to see things around us. What do we use to see things? We use our eyes to see things around us. Which organ helps in the digestion of food? The stomach plays a key role in the digestion of food. Which organ helps in the digestion of food? The stomach plays a key role in the digestion of food. What are the bones in our head called? The bones in our head are called the skull. What are the bones in our head called? The bones in our head are called the skull. Which part of the body supports our body and allows us to stand upright? The spine supports our body and helps us stand upright. Which part of the body supports our body and allows us to stand upright? The spine supports our body and helps us stand upright. What is the outer layer of our skin called? The outer layer of our skin is called the epidermis. What is the outer layer of our skin called? The outer layer of our skin is called the epidermis. What do we use to taste food? We use our taste buds on the tongue to taste food. What do we use to taste food? We use our taste buds on the tongue to taste food. Which part of the body controls our movements? The muscles and the nervous system work together to control our movements. Which part of the body controls our movements? The muscles and the nervous system work together to control our movements. What is the largest organ in the human body? The skin is the largest organ in the human body. What is the largest organ in the human body? The skin is the largest organ in the human body. Which part of the body helps in hearing sounds? The ears help in hearing sounds by capturing vibrations. Which part of the body helps in hearing sounds? The ears help in hearing sounds by capturing vibrations. What is the function of the kidneys? The kidneys filter and remove waste products from the blood. 
What is the function of the kidneys? The kidneys filter and remove waste products from the blood. Which part of the body is responsible for producing insulin? The pancreas produces insulin to regulate blood sugar levels. Which part of the body is responsible for producing insulin? The pancreas produces insulin to regulate blood sugar levels. What is the purpose of the spleen? The spleen filters blood and helps in immune system function. What is the purpose of the spleen? The spleen filters blood and helps in immune system function. Which part of the body is responsible for producing red blood cells? The bone marrow produces red blood cells. Which part of the body is responsible for producing red blood cells? The bone marrow produces red blood cells. What is the function of the gallbladder? The gallbladder stores bile, which aids in digestion. What is the function of the gallbladder? The gallbladder stores bile, which aids in digestion. Which part of the body controls metabolism? The thyroid gland controls metabolism. Which part of the body controls metabolism? The thyroid gland controls metabolism. What are the tiny hair-like structures in the respiratory tract called? Cilia are the tiny hair-like structures in the respiratory tract. What are the tiny hair-like structures in the respiratory tract called? Cilia are the tiny hair-like structures in the respiratory tract. Which part of the body contains the taste receptors? Taste receptors are found on the taste buds especially on the tongue. Which part of the body contains the taste receptors? Taste receptors are found on the taste buds, especially on the tongue. What is the purpose of the appendix? The function of the appendix is not fully understood, but it may play a role in the immune system. What is the purpose of the appendix? The function of the appendix is not fully understood, but it may play a role in the immune system. Which part of the body is responsible for maintaining balance? The inner ear plays a crucial role in maintaining balance. Which part of the body is responsible for maintaining balance? The inner ear plays a crucial role in maintaining balance. What connects muscles to bones? Tendons connect muscles to bones. What connects muscles to bones? Tendons connect muscles to bones. Which part of the body regulates body temperature? The hypothalamus in the brain regulates body temperature. Which part of the body regulates body temperature? The hypothalamus in the brain regulates body temperature. What is the purpose of the thymus gland? The thymus gland plays a role in the development of the immune system. What is the purpose of the thymus gland? The thymus gland plays a role in the development of the immune system. 
which part of the body stores extra glucose as glycogen? The liver stores extra glucose as glycogen. Which part of the body stores extra glucose as glycogen? The liver stores extra glucose as glycogen. What is the purpose of the pituitary gland? The pituitary gland controls the release of hormones in the body. What is the purpose of the pituitary gland? The pituitary gland controls the release of hormones in the body. Which part of the body is responsible for filtering impurities from the blood? The liver filters impurities from the blood. Which part of the body is responsible for filtering impurities from the blood? The liver filters impurities from the blood. What are the three main types of blood vessels in the body? The three main types of blood vessels are arteries, veins, and capillaries. What are the three main types of blood vessels in the body? The three main types of blood vessels are arteries, veins, and capillaries. What is the role of the adrenal glands? The adrenal glands produce hormones that regulate stress and metabolism. What is the role of the adrenal glands? The adrenal glands produce hormones that regulate stress and metabolism. Which part of the body produces insulin? The pancreas produces insulin. Which part of the body produces insulin? The pancreas produces insulin. What is the purpose of the esophagus? The esophagus carries food from the mouth to the stomach. What is the purpose of the esophagus? The esophagus carries food from the mouth to the stomach. Which part of the body is responsible for producing white blood cells? The bone marrow produces white blood cells. Which part of the body is responsible for producing white blood cells? The bone marrow produces white blood cells. What is the function of the bladder? The bladder stores and releases urine. What is the function of the bladder? The bladder stores and releases urine. Which part of the body is responsible for the sense of touch? The skin is responsible for the sense of touch. Which part of the body is responsible for the sense of touch? The skin is responsible for the sense of touch. What is the purpose of the spleen in the immune system? The spleen filters blood and helps in immune system function. What is the purpose of the spleen in the immune system? The spleen filters blood and helps in immune system function. Which part of the body produces saliva? Saliva is produced by the salivary glands in the mouth. Which part of the body produces saliva? Saliva is produced by the salivary glands in the mouth. What is the function of the small intestine? The small intestine absorbs nutrients from digested food. What is the function of the small intestine? 
the small intestine absorbs nutrients from digested food. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of red and white blood cells? The bone marrow is responsible for the production of red and white blood cells. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of red and white blood cells? The bone marrow is responsible for the production of red and white blood cells. What is the purpose of the thyroid gland? The thyroid gland regulates metabolism. What is the purpose of the thyroid gland? The thyroid gland regulates metabolism. Which part of the body is involved in the sense of smell? The olfactory receptors in the nose are involved in the sense of smell. Which part of the body is involved in the sense of smell? The olfactory receptors in the nose are involved in the sense of smell. What is the function of the trachea? The trachea carries air from the mouth and nose to the lungs. What is the function of the trachea? The trachea carries air from the mouth and nose to the lungs. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of bile? The liver produces bile, which is stored in the gallbladder. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of bile? The liver produces bile, which is stored in the gallbladder. What is the purpose of the uvula in the throat? The uvula helps prevent food from entering the nasal cavity during swallowing. What is the purpose of the uvula in the throat? The uvula helps prevent food from entering the nasal cavity during swallowing. Which part of the body regulates blood pressure? The kidneys play a role in regulating blood pressure. Which part of the body regulates blood pressure? The kidneys play a role in regulating blood pressure. What is the function of the cornea in the eye? The cornea helps focus light entering the eye. What is the function of the cornea in the eye? The cornea helps focus light entering the eye. Which part of the body produces insulin? The pancreas produces insulin to regulate blood sugar levels. Which part of the body produces insulin? The pancreas produces insulin to regulate blood sugar levels. What is the purpose of the diaphragm in breathing? The diaphragm contracts and expands to facilitate breathing. What is the purpose of the diaphragm in breathing? The diaphragm contracts and expands to facilitate breathing. Which part of the body is responsible for the sense of taste? Taste buds on the tongue are responsible for the sense of taste. Which part of the body is responsible for the sense of taste? Taste buds on the tongue are responsible for the sense of taste. What is the function of the epiglottis in the throat? The epiglottis prevents food from entering the windpipe during swallowing. What is the function of the epiglottis in the throat? 
The epiglottis prevents food from entering the windpipe during swallowing. Which part of the body is responsible for filtering and removing toxins? The kidneys filter and remove toxins from the blood. Which part of the body is responsible for filtering and removing toxins? The kidneys filter and remove toxins from the blood. What is the purpose of the alveoli in the lungs? The alveoli are tiny air sacs in the lungs where oxygen is exchanged for carbon dioxide in the bloodstream. What is the purpose of the alveoli in the lungs? The alveoli are tiny air sacs in the lungs where oxygen is exchanged for carbon dioxide in the bloodstream. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of melatonin? The pineal gland produces melatonin, regulating sleep-wake cycles. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of melatonin? The pineal gland produces melatonin, regulating sleep-wake cycles. What is the function of the eustachian tube in the ear? The eustachian tube equalizes pressure between the middle ear and the atmosphere. What is the function of the eustachian tube in the ear? The eustachian tube equalizes pressure between the middle ear and the atmosphere. Which part of the body is responsible for storing excess fat? Adipose tissue, found throughout the body, stores excess fat. Which part of the body is responsible for storing excess fat? Adipose tissue, found throughout the body, stores excess fat. What is the purpose of the peristalsis in the digestive system? Peristalsis is the muscular contraction that propels food through the digestive tract. What is the purpose of the peristalsis in the digestive system? Peristalsis is the muscular contraction that propels food through the digestive tract. Which part of the body is responsible for producing tears? The tear glands, or lacrimal glands, produce tears to lubricate and protect the eyes. Which part of the body is responsible for producing tears? The tear glands, or lacrimal glands, produce tears to lubricate and protect the eyes. What is the function of the prostate gland in males? The prostate gland produces seminal fluid that nourishes and transports sperm. What is the function of the prostate gland in males? The prostate gland produces seminal fluid that nourishes and transports sperm. Which part of the body is responsible for regulating body temperature through sweat? Sweat glands in the skin help regulate body temperature by producing sweat. Which part of the body is responsible for regulating body temperature through sweat? Sweat glands in the skin help regulate body temperature by producing sweat. What is the purpose of the ciliary muscles in the eye? Ciliary muscles adjust the shape of the lens to facilitate focusing on objects at different distances. What is the purpose of the ciliary muscles in the eye? 
ciliary muscles adjust the shape of the lens to facilitate focusing on objects at different distances. Which part of the body is responsible for storing and releasing glucose as needed? The liver stores and releases glucose to maintain blood sugar levels. Which part of the body is responsible for storing and releasing glucose as needed? The liver stores and releases glucose to maintain blood sugar levels. What is the function of the vas deferens in males? The vas deferens transports sperm from the testes to the urethra. What is the function of the vas deferens in males? The vas deferens transports sperm from the testes to the urethra. Which part of the body produces the hormone oxytocin? The hypothalamus and the pituitary gland produce oxytocin, regulating social bonding and reproductive functions. Which part of the body produces the hormone oxytocin? The hypothalamus and the pituitary gland produce oxytocin, regulating social bonding and reproductive functions. What is the purpose of the adrenal medulla? The adrenal medulla produces adrenaline, involved in the fight or flight response. What is the purpose of the adrenal medulla? The adrenal medulla produces adrenaline, involved in the fight or flight response. Which part of the body is responsible for filtering out impurities from the lymphatic system? Lymph nodes filter impurities from the lymphatic system. Which part of the body is responsible for filtering out impurities from the lymphatic system? Lymph nodes filter impurities from the lymphatic system. What is the function of the gallbladder in the digestive process? The gallbladder stores and releases bile to aid in the digestion of fats. What is the function of the gallbladder in the digestive process? The gallbladder stores and releases bile to aid in the digestion of fats. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of insulin and glucagon? The pancreas produces insulin to lower blood sugar and glucagon to raise it. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of insulin and glucagon? The pancreas produces insulin to lower blood sugar and glucagon to raise it. What is the purpose of the uvula in the throat? The uvula helps prevent food from entering the nasal passage during swallowing. What is the purpose of the uvula in the throat? The uvula helps prevent food from entering the nasal passage during swallowing. Which part of the body is responsible for maintaining electrolyte balance? The kidneys play a crucial role in maintaining electrolyte balance in the body. Which part of the body is responsible for maintaining electrolyte balance? The kidneys play a crucial role in maintaining electrolyte balance in the body. What is the function of the meibomian glands in the eyes? Meibomian glands secrete oil to prevent the evaporation of tears and keep the eyes moist. What is the function of the meibomian glands in the eyes? 
Meibomian glands secrete oil to prevent the evaporation of tears and keep the eyes moist. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of red blood cells? Red blood cells are produced in the bone marrow. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of red blood cells? Red blood cells are produced in the bone marrow. What is the purpose of the semicircular canals in the inner ear? Semicircular canals help maintain balance and spatial orientation. What is the purpose of the semicircular canals in the inner ear? Semicircular canals help maintain balance and spatial orientation. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of serotonin? Serotonin is produced in the brain and intestines, regulating mood and gastrointestinal functions. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of serotonin? Serotonin is produced in the brain and intestines, regulating mood and gastrointestinal functions. What is the function of the pons in the brainstem? The pons helps regulate breathing and other vital functions. What is the function of the pons in the brainstem? The pons helps regulate breathing and other vital functions. Which part of the body is responsible for regulating blood clotting? Platelets in the blood and various proteins regulate blood clotting. Which part of the body is responsible for regulating blood clotting? Platelets in the blood and various proteins regulate blood clotting. What is the purpose of the endometrium in females? The endometrium is the inner lining of the uterus, where a fertilized egg implants during pregnancy. What is the purpose of the endometrium in females? The endometrium is the inner lining of the uterus, where a fertilized egg implants during pregnancy. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of estrogen and progesterone? The ovaries produce estrogen and progesterone in females. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of estrogen and progesterone? The ovaries produce estrogen and progesterone in females. What is the function of the synovial fluid in joints? Synovial fluid lubricates joints, reducing friction and facilitating smooth movement. What is the function of the synovial fluid in joints? Synovial fluid lubricates joints, reducing friction and facilitating smooth movement. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of insulin? The pancreas produces insulin to regulate blood sugar levels. Which part of the body is responsible for the production of insulin? The pancreas produces insulin to regulate blood sugar levels. What is the purpose of the cecum in the digestive system? The cecum is the pouch at the beginning of the large intestine, where some digestion and absorption occur. What is the purpose of the cecum in the digestive system? The cecum is the pouch at the beginning of the large intestine, where some digestion and absorption occur. 
which part of the body is responsible for producing growth hormone. The pituitary gland produces growth hormone, regulating growth and development. Which part of the body is responsible for producing growth hormone? The pituitary gland produces growth hormone, regulating growth and development. What is the function of the corpus callosum in the brain? The corpus callosum connects the two hemispheres of the brain, facilitating communication between them. What is the function of the corpus callosum in the brain? The corpus callosum connects the two hemispheres of the brain, facilitating communication between them. Which part of the body is responsible for filtering and removing old or damaged red blood cells? The spleen filters and removes old or damaged red blood cells. Which part of the body is responsible for filtering and removing old or damaged red blood cells? The spleen filters and removes old or damaged red blood cells. What is the purpose of the thymus gland in the immune system? The thymus gland plays a role in the development of T cells, a type of white blood cell. What is the purpose of the thymus gland in the immune system? The thymus gland plays a role in the development of T cells, a type of white blood cell. Which part of the body is responsible for producing insulin? The pancreas produces insulin to regulate blood sugar levels. Which part of the body is responsible for producing insulin? The pancreas produces insulin to regulate blood sugar levels. What is the function of the papillae on the tongue? Papillae contain taste buds and contribute to the sense of taste. What is the function of the papillae on the tongue? Papillae contain taste buds and contribute to the sense of taste. Which part of the body is responsible for producing bile? The liver produces bile, which is stored in the gallbladder and released into the small intestine. Which part of the body is responsible for producing bile? The liver produces bile, which is stored in the gallbladder and released into the small intestine. What is the purpose of the choroid in the eye? The choroid provides blood supply to the retina and absorbs excess light. What is the purpose of the choroid in the eye? The choroid provides blood supply to the retina and absorbs excess light. Which part of the body is responsible for producing and secreting melatonin? The pineal gland produces and secretes melatonin, regulating sleep-wake cycles. Which part of the body is responsible for producing and secreting melatonin? The pineal gland produces and secretes melatonin, regulating sleep-wake cycles. What is the function of the mucus in the respiratory system? Mucus traps and removes particles, preventing them from entering the lungs. What is the function of the mucus in the respiratory system? Mucus traps and removes particles, preventing them from entering the lungs. 
which part of the body is responsible for regulating calcium levels in the blood. The parathyroid glands regulate calcium levels in the blood. Which part of the body is responsible for regulating calcium levels in the blood? The parathyroid glands regulate calcium levels in the blood. What is the purpose of the aorta in the circulatory system? The aorta carries oxygenated blood from the heart to the rest of the body. What is the purpose of the aorta in the circulatory system? The aorta carries oxygenated blood from the heart to the rest of the body. Which part of the body is responsible for producing insulin? The pancreas produces insulin to regulate blood sugar levels. Which part of the body is responsible for producing insulin? The pancreas produces insulin to regulate blood sugar levels.